I'm the type of person who lives to be the trendsetter and push boundaries. As a young entrepreneur with cerebral palsy, my hope and expectations are driven by need and also by passion to make current fashion more accessible, faster to market, and most of all, fun. I have been exploring this potential career path since high school, when I was adapting traditional store-bought patterns for my own use in a fashion design class. I began experimenting with different closure systems like Velcro and magnets, shortened length for the wheelchair user, or wider openings at the neck. That led to a connection with a new entity called Runway of Dreams, out of New York. I was invited by Runway of Dreams to model for Tommy Hilfiger Adaptive at a major runway show attended by 600 fashion executives and celebrities. My outfit was designed specifically for me. Even though UF doesn't offer a fashion program per se, it has exposed me to a network of professionals who led to amazing opportunities within the fashion industry. In 2017, I attended the Women's Entrepreneurship Seminar sponsored by Warrington. We went up to meet the keynote speaker, Barbara Bradley Beckgard, co-founder of the global brand, Vera Bradley. We connected immediately under a common passion of inclusion. I wanted to show her how the Vera backpack I was carrying could be adapted for wheelchair users. I kept in touch by texting her. A few weeks later, my parents and I received an invitation to be her special guest at the Designs for Disabilities Gala. From the moment I rolled into Warrington, I felt at home. A place where I could push myself but also a place where I could challenge Warrington to think of diversity in a whole new way. I'm going to be honest and say that I sense the panic expressions of the faculty and student leaders who probably wondered how best to provide accommodations while upholding the integrity of the program. We made it work as a team. UF provided the most amazing platform for me to speak up about my passions. I am able to advocate not only for myself, but for others as well, and this gives me joy. Diversity and inclusion go hand in hand at Florida, and I feel accepted here and love the independence. My future is wide open to opportunity. My goal is to help refine the consumer experience in retail, both brick and mortar and online, into a more inclusive experience for all. I am also considering applying to the Masters of Science Entrepreneurship program here at UF to build my lifestyle brand fearless independence into a major consulting firm. Talk to me in three years. It's gonna be great.